cranium, jawbone, clavicle, scapula, sternum, ribcage, spine, pelvis, humerus, ulna, radius, carpal, metacarpals, phalanges, femur, patella, tibia, fibula, tarsals, metatarsals, phalanges. The human body has a structure of bones inside called a skeleton. There are more than 200 bones in the human body. Many animals also have a skeleton. The joints in our skeletal system allow the body to move smoothly. Ligaments and muscles help to hold the skeleton together to help the body move and bend smoothly. The role of the skeleton is to support the body, help with movement and to keep organs in place and to protect them. The cranium is the skull that holds and protects the brain and eyes. It also supports the face and gives it a structure. The jawbone is known as the mandible. It contains teeth and helps us to move our mouth whilst talking, biting and eating. The collarbone is known as the clavicle. This bone supports the shoulders in movement. The scapular bones are the shoulder blades. The breastbone is known as the sternum. It's in the center of our chest and is a flat bone that works with the rib cage to provide protection for organs. The rib cage holds and protects the heart and lungs. It also provides help with breathing. The spine or spinal column is behind and it protects the spinal cord. The spine is made up of small bones called vertebrae. The spine is very important as it helps to hold us straight, providing structure and support with movement. The pelvis is a bone that holds and protects the pelvic organs. It also helps support the weight of the body. The humerus is a long bone in our upper arm. This goes all the way from our shoulder to the elbow. It works to provide movement and support. The ulna and radius form the lower arm. This goes all the way down from the elbow to the wrist. The carpal bone is the bone of our wrist. Metacarpals are the bones in our hand. Phalanges are the bones in our fingers. Femur. This is the longest bone in the body. It supports the weight of the upper body and helps with movement. The kneecap is called the patella. This is where the femur meets the shin bone called tibia. It helps to protect the knee joint and connects the muscles to allow easy movement of the knee. The lower part of the leg is made up of two bones tibia and fibula, tarsals. Metatarsals make up the foot and phalanges are the toes.